Hey there, I'm hiking for health today at Los Vaqueros Watershed. It's a nice little reservoir tucked into the uh, East Bay Hills near Livermore, um, Antioch area. It's kind of right in between there, um, also near the uh, Mount Diablo area. So that's where I'm at today. So Las Vaqueros Watershed is um, one of many really nice uh, parks. I'm not sure if the watershed is part of East Bay Regional Park, but there are many East Bay Regional Parks in this area. We are kind of semi-north, east side of Livermore, Danville, Mount Diablo area. So that uh, area there. And this is a large area that has just lots of trails in it just by itself. And then like I said, near it, um, like within 10 minutes of this, uh, actually Los Vaqueros here connects with uh, Round Valley East Bay Regional Preserve, which I have done a uh, trail report on before. It's a great place with several trails to go. Um, it also hooks up with the Morgan Territory, which is an East Bay Regional Park, I believe. Vasco Caves, which is a, uh, a closed off area. You can only get there on special appointment, special days that they do tours of the caves that are there. Um, and then also nearby here is the Black Diamond Regional Park, Contra Loma Regional Park. So there are many. And then of course you have all the stuff, everything from a state park to uh, regional parks all around Mount Diablo. And all within 10-15 minutes of this area right here. So this area is just amazing as far as trails go. And uh, it is like a lot of the other trails. It's, it's uh, mostly hilly grasslands dotted with uh, some really nice oaks. You can see the train in the background that I'm heading towards. It's just like that, there's a lot of that. I was just up, and you'll see the pictures and things up into that area, up in the hills there. So a lot of places to hike. Uh, you come here in one day, you probably couldn't do all of the trails, especially if you go my pace, if you know what I mean. Um, so this is definitely a place where it's you know worth, um, worth several trips. The trails vary. There are some trails that are for hikers only, some trails that allow hikers and equestrians, some that allow everybody, including uh, uh, bicycles. So there's something for everybody here. And, uh, and also, if you head up over the trails this way, uh, I've been there before. You'll see my uh, hike report on Round Valley to Los Vaquero that I did before. Um, there's a nice uh, reservoir, there's a nice lake to, uh, to see. So that's how we go.
So today I was on the Kellogg Creek Trail and I did a little bit on the grease. I think it's the grease something trail. I know, I'm, I'm just great with those names. But I was just on it and that was an actual nice one that took me up some elevation work, which is what I tried to get in today is some elevation work. So that took me up into the hills back there, that trail way back there you can see. That took me up into the hills and up on top of those and around the other side and uh, came out over here, got on the Kellogg Creek Trail and I'm kind of following it around. Um, not doing a whole lot of miles today because I was working on elevation work and that really got some good work in. That was um, something close to 400, 500 feet in a very short distance, so it was a pretty steep climb. And um, it's been pretty good. So uh, like the other East Bay Regional Parks that I've been to in this area, I gotta tell you, uh, definitely worth it. Um, there are bathrooms in the parking areas, uh, picnic areas, barbecues, all that kind of stuff is available. Um, and like I say, the trails run the gambit from uh, equestrian to bicycle to uh, hiking and, and everything in between. And a lot of good stuff to, to do out here. And like I said, I've only been on a couple of the trails. There's a whole bunch of them here. A lot to do. So I'll probably be back to uh, review some of the other trails. But the uh, Kellogg Creek Trail, if I keep following it, will go um, all the way to the uh, lake edge. And I've been there before, so I'm not going to go today to the lake edge. I'm only getting, like I say, I'm trying to work on uh, elevation work and stuff like that. Um, but Los Vaqueros Watershed, by the way, it's not East Bay Regional Parks. It is the Contra Costa Water District that runs this. Um, but they are attached to several East Bay Regional Parks. You can get here through some of those uh, parks if you're hiking. If you want to do some long distance hiking, it's possible to do that in this area. You just go through all the parks. Um, other than that, Los Vaqueros Watershed. It's been a lot of fun, and that's uh, my hike report for this place for now. But I'll be back on some of the other trails, and I'll uh, share them with you. See you later.